Daughter says go and they're racing away. Coffee Shake just perhaps a half a length slow along with Sports Coach. Not much speed on in the early stages. Hard Rocks and the Blue Silks restrained to the inside and Rainers Kings on the right hand side is now going to come forward to dispute the lead and Coffee Shake is also now right there in the vanguard. Only a half a length separating the first three runners. Living with Heart. Kings Bay tucked up towards the inside. White Sleeves and Red Cap. Sports Coach behind these. Tennessee Strategy and Guantanamera is in touch with them. Four lengths off the leader. Hard Rocks in the Blue Silks, Coffee Shake between them the Black Cap. Rainers Kings to the stand side and Kings Bay now going to come forward towards the inside, still under the bridle. Further back in the running, living with Hart. Hard Rock as they come to the 300, look left. Here comes Kings Bay about to be popped the question. Coffee Shakes down the centre. Kings Bay, Ian Sturgeon says, let's go, let's go and put this to bed. Guantanamera is running on, but Kings Bay with a sweeping run. Another scintillating victory, and this is the real deal. Kings Bay equal to the task, gear down. Hard Rock sec, and then came sports coach Guantanamera, and living with heart, Kings Bay steps into the limelight today, and he beats the big guns. Well, if you weren't convinced, today I'm certainly convinced. This is the real deal. Kings Bay with total authority. Just look at that elastic-like action. He's obviously stepped up and taken on some really good sprinters here. And he's destroyed them in a manner of a good horse. Coming to the 400, he was in touch with them. And as soon as Ian Sturgeon just gave him a flick with the whip, that was it. Race over. And in these 1,000-meter sprints, when they can get geared down the last 50 and just enjoy the scenery, this is a horse, certainly. He's done it already, and he's done it again. He's done superbly well for the connections. Well done to Doug Campbell, Ian Sturgeon. He beats Hard Rock in second. Sports coach comes out third best after losing a little bit of ground, stayed on, and then came Guantanamera behind these, living with heart. Coming to the 300 and Kings Bay, he looked absolutely full of running when he came forward. And you'll see just a flick or two down the neck and then Ian Sturgeon's going to glance over his shoulder. And I'm sure he can't believe the manner in which this horse is disposed of this field today. And then just glances on the inside to make sure nothing's sneaking through. And then he just gears down Kings Bay. Another supremely effortless victory. Turn a foot second to none as we hand you back to the studio. Well, another sparkling performance by a very, very talented horse, and uh, Kings Bay has played with this field. He's, he's a really smart horse, this, and he's a stakes horse written all over him. He's got bigger fish to fry. Well done, Fish. He quickens beautifully, doesn't he? Yeah, Mr. Laff, I thought uh, this was his toughest task, you know, so far in his career, and he handled it with absolute ease. You know, he's getting better and better, and well done to Doug and his team. Excellent. Well done with your double. Thank you, Mr. Laff. Uh, I must say a big thank you to Doug. He's uh, supported me a lot over the years, and I really appreciate it. The owners as well, I really appreciate it. My sponsors, Sucraj Racing, TMT Digital, All Kill Pest Control. Thank you very much. Anybody else? That's about it. Thanks. About and it. Excellent. Thank you to you, Miss Laff. I appreciate it. Don't miss your flight. <laughs> I won't. Thank you. Lovely. Doug, come and have a chat. Well done, Doug. You've done a wonderful job with the sauce, and he, he, he's, he's all quality. He is. He surprises me every time he runs now, because he's not a great horse to look at. He's very ordinary, and at home he's just uh, part of the string. You don't even yeah. notice him. Um, but he's got a hang of a heart and a hell of a stride on him. You know? I think that acceleration what catches me. He, they're going quickly, and he's yeah. just waiting to pounce. That's right. Uh, Ian said going through the 400, he's still doing a half pace. He let him go. I thought he'd gone too soon. Cause yeah. I, and, but he just does it so easily. It's yeah. wonderful to have and a horse like Useful him. horses behind him, Doug. Uh, could he go a mile? You know, this is what I know Dennis Dry and Michael Roberts are both city. Why don't you try him over a mile? Because yeah. it could be a nice horse for the Guineas, you know. It could be a Guineas horse. That's what you hope. But you know, a couple of jockeys said to me, keep them over sprints when they're winning. It's, yeah. I've got to you know, give it a lot of thought now. Doug, yeah. you bred him. You're, you're a part owner. You've got to make the call. But yeah. watching him settle, Doug, you know, he might be a fantastic miler one day. Who knows? Sure. We always dream on these horses. <laughs> Keeps us going. Yeah. Makes us get up in the morning. As long as they keep winning, Doug. Thank you very much, Paul. Congratulations. Thanks so much. Okay. Dave, come and have a chat. Well, it's wonderful to be part of a, a super horse like this, especially a horse who's won six and he's only three.
Well, yeah, it's, it's a major surprise to me. Um, Doug stole my line. I was going to say this horse surprises every time it runs, which he does because he always moves up in a different league. Yeah. And today we thought he might just meet his match, but he came away very, very well. A very impressive run. Yeah, and it's, it's wonderful. You've got so much to look forward to. Well, we have. We don't know where next or how far we should put him. Um, mm -hmm. Difficult to find 1,200-meter races in KZN. Yeah. Um, but I'm sure Doug will place him, you know, and thanks to Doug and to Di. And well done to Mickey and Rochelle. They're not here today, but I'm here to hold the candle. Well done, Dave. Thank you. There we go. What a wonderful performance by this young horse. He, he really is a top horse, and uh, he's got stakes races written all over him. So well done to all the connections. Kings Bay at a canter.